Why am I not a professional at this unity? I don't know. Good morning, Hoshman Vikings. Buenos dias. I'm a student who was a grade six grader and an even better middle school unity. And I'm the teacher who tried to teach eighth grade, but then I got demoted back to seventh grade, Miss Crum. You're gonna have to go back to where you belong. Miss Christian basically kicked me out at 244. <laughs> Today is Wednesday, August 10th, 2022. Today is a white day, which means we are going to our B day classes. off with Harshman happenings. In addition to all of your fabulous teachers here at Harshman, we have many staff members that are here to support you. Let's meet a few of them now. Hi, I am Ms. Radcliffe and I am in the main office I am also the dress code warden. Hi, I'm Miss Gray, and I do all things registration. Hi, I'm Miss Murphy, and I do family and community engagement here at Harshman. So love talking to your parents and love making sure that we've got great partners in the building supporting you guys. Hi, I am Mr. Rojas, and I am the bilingual assistant. And uh, my boss uh, is uh, Miss Murphy right here. And anything that she needs, I, I, I can take care of it. <laughs> I love my teachers, like you, Miss Crum. But I also really appreciate Miss Thomas because even though she isn't my teacher, she is fun and helpful. Now it's time for. Where? Wow, well, a Wednesday. Perspective. 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 The way you view or see something. When I want to treat someone with empathy, I remind myself to see the other person's perspective. Walk a now in their shoes. Is that why it smells like feet in Mr. Hesser's room? Because he's always taking his shoes off to walk in somebody else's? Miss Crumb, that is not what that means. That is not empathetic. Whoops, I'm still a work in progress. Kind of like Mr. Hesser's room. It's time for Before You Go, Stay in the Know. Many of us know about water births, but at the YMCA? Last week, 29 year old Tessa Ryder was a few days past her due date. And while she was swimming at the Y in Northern Colorado, her wait was over. 18-year-old lifeguard Natalie Lucas ran over to help. Without time for the paramedics to get there, she helped deliver the baby on the pool deck. Lucas had emergency training, but probably not for situations like this. I will add that to the list of reasons I do not want to be a lifeguard. Mm -hmm. Mrs. Wallace, be sure you stay away from the YMCA pool. Well, that's the news for now. Make it a wonderful Wednesday.